After a 3-0 win at Werder Bremen, expectation was high for Schalke fans as they faced promoted Darmstadt. We saw Marcel Heller score two excellent goals in an opening day draw against Hanover. Sure enough, they exceeded perhaps even their own expectations nine minutes in. A long ball up to the impressive Dominic Straw angle led to a chance for Konstantin Rausch. This was his first Bundesliga goal in 18 months. Dirk Schuster said his side had come to the Veltins Arena to frustrate Schalke. And they did that in the first half, restricting them to long-range efforts. Julian Draxler coming close shortly after Schalke had gone behind. The Schalke fans desperate to see Draxler stay at the club this season. It is a Schalke side still without captain and central defender Benedict Irvides. But right after the restart, Schalke were in front. They found a way through thanks to their best player on the day. Draxler rolling the ball home beautifully after a fantastic cross from Franco De Santo on his competitive home debut. 1-1 with a half to play. But Darmstadt showed the character that got them promoted. Tight and compact, refusing to allow Schalke through. Although they needed a moment of luck with 15 minutes to play, and free-kick specialist Johannes Geis smacked the crossbar. Schalke would see the ball hit the frame of the goal again, but it would have been an undeserved winner. Roman Neustadter's long-distance header was tipped onto the post by goalkeeper Christian Matenia, who fought to deny Klaas-Jan Huntelaar on the follow-up. It summed up Darmstadt's fighting spirit as Schuster's side claimed an excellent 1-1 draw at Schalke.